Of course. Okay, so um, Aaron, oops, hang on, I'm trying to type and test talk at the same time. Yeah. Okay, so Aaron said that she's good, but then asked what time, so we might be a couple minutes. Okay, that's fine. So, but I think she's coming. Okay. FYI, I'm <laughs> I'm here working, so I will hear everything going on. I, um, just say something to me and because I may not be watching, I may be on another screen or whatever, but I probably will have to admit Erin in is what I'm saying. Oh, okay. Okay. She said that her Zoom is still downloading, but she'll be on ASAP. Okay. Well, then I'll just kind of stay here and hang till I see her and then admit her in. Okay. Perfect. That sounds great. Awesome. So Randy, um, I don't know if you saw or remember this week, uh, the last two weeks changed a little bit. So, um, the first round of exercises are the skaters, mountain climbers, and plank jacks, but we go up in time each round, so it'll be 30 seconds the first round, 45 seconds, and then 60 seconds. Okay. And then, so then we'll rest for the same. So if we work for 30, we'll rest for 30. We work for 45, we rest for 45. Okay. And then the second round, the two exercises change, so we don't do burpees today. <sighs> um, yeah. <laughs> we do um, high knees and then fast feet with a lateral floor touch. Okay. Um, I'll demonstrate it, but that it's the same thing, 30 seconds, 45, and 60 seconds. Okay. And then I think the only change on the strength aspect um, is that all the other coaches were doing three sets of push-ups, so we went to three sets of push-ups. So it's 10 okay. standard, 10 clap push-ups, so. Okay, all right. Erin! I cannot do the 10 clap push-ups, but... I can't either. I can't even do push-ups for my from my toes so you know it's all right <laughs> I just say I'm performing the modified version yeah. and it makes it look like I know what I'm doing so Erin <laughs> can you hear us okay yeah I can hear you oh awesome okay so um I'll just go over really quick since uh you haven't done this before Randy jumped on for your the other athlete thanks Randy yep uh, so this is meant to be kind of like in real time. So when the athletes, when this gets posted on Thursday, they're just supposed to be able to push play and follow along. So I'll be cueing you guys in real time and talking. Um, I'll be going back and forth between doing some of the movements and then coming back and watching and cueing you guys and also encouraging you. Um, sometimes when I get wrapped up doing the exercises, I can tend not to talk as much and I wanna make sure that there's encouragement going on because I feel like that's really important. Um, but yeah, so we'll just kind of go through everything. Um, I have a warm up that we'll do for 30 seconds for each exercise. And then there's two rounds of exercises. Uh, the first round is skaters, mountain climbers, and plank jacks. Do you know those three? Yeah. Perfect. So then this week is, uh, the last two weeks have been different. It's 30 seconds, then uh, 45 seconds the second round, 60 seconds the last round. And then we'll do another circuit of high knees and fast feet with a lateral floor touch, um, which is just like really quick feet to the side, touch the floor, really quick feet back, touch the floor. Um, same thing there, 30 seconds, then 45 and then 60 seconds. So that's the cardio part. Um, for the strength aspect, we have three sets of 10 push-ups, um, then directly followed by 10 clap push-ups. Um, how do you feel about those? Um, I can't really do them, but they said, like, if you can't do it, then, like, just do, like, the push off. Push. Yep. Yeah. Yep, perfect. Okay. So we'll do those, and then we got air squats, jump squats, alternating lunges, dead bugs, and planks, and then we'll be done, and we'll stretch. So, any questions? Nope. Cool. Okay. So, hang on, there's a spider. Oh. Okay, didn't want to look at it. Um, so uh, just a reminder for the warm-up, I did take um, the high knee hold out um, just because you guys are doing high knees like later on in the workout. I felt like we didn't need to do that in the warm-up. So just a reminder, jog in place, jumping jacks, then we have butt kicks, in and out jacks, um, just a reminder on this one. It's just like a normal jumping jack, so your feet are doing the same things, but then your hands are gonna come in, and so you'll do an in jack, 
and then just a regular jump into jack. So you just alternate hands in, hands out, hands in, hands out, and that's <laughs> And then in and out squat hops. It's just like a squat jump. So you're gonna you're gonna do like the jumping jack, squat and touch the floor, come back, do another jump, squat, touch the floor, and come back. That's all that is. Okay. Oh, hang on. We're having so. Can you guys hear me? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Coach Delp just said that I'm very quiet. When you're like farther from the phone, then like it's hard to hear. But when you're like okay. right there. You're good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll just try to yell <laughs> and I'm back there. So, okay. I'll keep an eye on that. I'll keep my chat open as well. If at any point, um, Aaron, we kind of had a small hiccup. My laptop is automatically muting me sometimes. So if for some reason you can't hear me at all, but I'm talking, just let me know and we'll try to back up and figure out where, where I got lost. Okay. Cool. Okay. So I'm going to do like a little spiel saying, you know, welcome to the last week of workouts. I'm going to introduce you guys. Um, Aaron, your last name is pronounced Litke, right? Yes. Awesome. Okay. All right. So I'm just going to introduce you guys. You guys can wave and then we'll probably just jump right in since it's the last week. Cool. Yep. So we're going to start now. So Hey guys, welcome to your last week of workouts. Uh, welcome to the last Thursday workout. Last time you're ever gonna have to do this workout, uh, maybe. But hope you guys are doing well and that you guys have been sticking with it. Just wanna encourage you to finish strong. We have today and tomorrow. And we'll be done with our workouts for June. Hopefully you guys have been putting in the time and effort. It's gonna be well worth it when we come back in July and when we can compete this fall. So today I have uh, an athlete coming back for a second time. We have Miranda Garman, and we also have Aaron Lidke from the volleyball team. Thank you guys for jumping in and doing this workout today. Since we're so close to the end, I'm not gonna waste any time. We're just gonna get started right away. So we're gonna go ahead and get warmed up. We got 30 seconds for each exercise. We're just gonna start off nice and easy. We're in a jogging place, ready? And begin. Just gonna do a nice, easy drive here. Try to get the heart rate up. Job. Nice job. Already almost halfway. Nothing crazy. Nice job. Ten more seconds here. Nice job. Two, one, and done. Nice job. Right away, we're going to go into jumping jacks. Ready and go. Nice job, guys. Make sure you take those arms all the way above your head. Nice job. Halfway. Nice job. Three, two, one, and done. Nice job. All right, moving right along, we have back kicks. Ready? And go. Try to get your heel all the way up to your hips. Nice job. Nice soft landing on those toes. Halfway. Nice job, guys. Five more seconds here. Three, two, one, and done. All right, next one here. We have in and out jacks. Just a reminder, feet are doing the same thing as a regular jumping jack. But your hands are gonna come together for an in, then we're gonna come back out. We're just gonna repeat, okay? We got 30 seconds and begin. Nice job, guys. And then we're just trying to get warmed up. Nice job. 10 more seconds. 
seconds here. Two, one, and done. All right, last in here we have is in and out squat hops. It's gonna be like a small jump squat. You're gonna jump, squat to the floor, come back, jump, squat to the floor, come back. Last 30 seconds of our warm up, ready? And begin. Really get those legs warmed up here. Nice job. Make sure you're alternating your hand up to the floor. Ten more seconds. Three. All right, let's go ahead and stretch it out. I'm gonna take that right arm all the way across, pull that elbow to our chest, relax that shoulder. Nice job. Three, two, one. Other arm, same thing. Pull it all the way across, relax that shoulder. Don't let it hike up. Nice job. Three, two, one. I'm gonna take our right arm. We're gonna bring that elbow up. Take that elbow, gently push it back. Stretch out that tricep. Relax your neck on this one. Little chest and shrug. Three, two, one. Shake it out. We're gonna go to the other arm. Nice job. And we'll hold for three, two, one. While we're standing, we're just gonna reach nice and long towards our toes. Yeah. Where's she at? I don't know. Nice job. If you can't reach this far, you can come to your calves or your shins. You can come to your knees if you need to. But try to get as far to the floor as you can. Three, two, one, and back up. We're gonna take a nice big step to the right. We're gonna send that hip back. We're just gonna come right down to our right knee. Really stretch out that inner thigh. Nice job. Hold for three, two, one. We'll go to the other side. Nice job. And we'll hold for three, two, one, we'll come back up. All right, grab a drink if you need it. Before we get started, I'm gonna go ahead and just run through our circuits one more time. Again, this week, we have the same circuit that we've been doing with skaters, mountain climbers, and plank jacks. But this time we're gonna be increasing our time. So we've got 30 seconds of work, 30 seconds of rest, then we'll go to 45 seconds and then 60 seconds for our last round. Then we'll go into our second circuit, which is new. It's our high knees and our fast feet with the lateral floor touch. Same thing, we're gonna do 30 seconds, then 45 seconds, then 60 seconds, okay? You guys ready to go? Yep. All right. First things, we're, we're gonna go ahead and start off with our skaters. We got 30 seconds, ready? And begin. Good job, guys. Really think about nice, powerful steps each way. Really push side to side. Really challenge your balance here. Nice job. Over halfway. Got about 10 seconds left. Got three, two, one, and done. Nice job. All right, right away we're gonna go into our mountain climbers. Ready? And begin. Really drive 
right with those knees. if you need it. Got about 15 more seconds. This next round, we got 45 seconds of work, and we'll get 45 seconds of rest. All right, we're starting up again here. In three, two, one, and begin. Back to skaters. Nice powerful push offs here. Nice job. 15 seconds in. Nice job. That's 20 more seconds. Last 15. 10 more. Keep pushing. Three, two, one, and done. All right, we're going to go to mountain climbers now. Again with your mountain climbers, make sure that you're not extended, your shoulders too far back, you don't end up here, stay nice and stacked above, have your shoulders be above your wrists. All right, 45 seconds, ready, and begin. Randy. Nice job, Aaron. Keep pushing here. 20 more seconds. Nice job, nice job. Last 15. Nice job, nice pace, guys. Four, three, two, one, and done. 
Nice job, guys. Grab a drink. All right, we have one more round. Then we're gonna move to our second circuit. Get a little bit longer rest here. Got 20 more seconds to rest. All right, we're gonna start up with skaters in 10 seconds here. Last round, we're going for one minute. Ready in three, two, one, and begin. Hey. Hey. <laughs> nice job, nice job. Way to be powerful there, Aaron. Nice job, Randy, nice pace. Nice job. Nice job, nice job. Really challenges your balance here. Good work. You guys are halfway. Nice job, nice job. Way to use your arms here, both to balance and to generate power. Nice job. Last 15 seconds, guys. Nice work, nice work. Keep going, you got five more seconds. Three, two, one, and done. Nice job, guys. Take a quick breather. All right, we're going to mountain climbers here. One minute mountain climbers ready, and begin. Nice job, nice pace. Nice job, ladies. Nice job. Way to keep your hips low. Great work, great work. Keep pushing, you guys are halfway. You got it, you got it. You got less than 25 seconds. Here we go. Last couple minutes of work on this circuit. You need to absolutely reset. Nice job, 10 more seconds, guys. Keep pushing, keep pushing, nice pace, way to go. Three, two, one, and done. Nice job, guys. Take a minute, roll out those shoulders, stretch what you need to. Our last exercise here is plank jacks, all right? Last minute of the circuit, ready, and begin. Nice job, Randy. Nice job, Aaron. Nice job, nice job. For those of you following along at home, absolutely, if you need to stop, reset your shoulders, Roll them out a little bit, absolutely do so, totally fine. Keep going, you guys are halfway. Nice job, nice job. Double check that those wrists are under the shoulders, that's gonna help those shoulders a lot. Last 15 seconds here. Got it guys, last 10. We're done in three, two, one, and done. Nice job, guys. Absolutely get some water, catch your breath. While you guys are resting, I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate the next two exercises in our last circuit. All right, what we have for this last circuit, we're gonna do a lateral, feet with a lateral floor touch. You guys know high knees are gonna be stationary, gonna be driving those knees up nice and high. You wanna make sure 
Try to get them as close to your chest as possible. Our fast feet lateral floor touch is going to be like having an agility ladder. So you're going to move fast feet to the side, touch the floor, fast feet back, touch the floor. You can set a comes, go nice and far apart. You can use the space that you have. I like to do a nice three count. So one, two, three, touch. One, two, three, touch. That's all we're going to be doing. Just back and forth. All right. We're going to start back up. We're going to do each of these for 30 seconds. And then we'll rest, okay? All right, we're going to start with my knees here. Ready? And begin. Nice soft landing on those toes. Really drive those knees high. Use that core to help drive those knees high. Ten seconds. Keep pushing. One and down. All right, thirty seconds here. Fast feet, lateral floor touch. Ready and begin. Nice job, guys. Two more rounds. This time we're going for 45 seconds. We're going to get started here in three, two, one, and begin. Nice job. Make sure you breathe. With all of these exercises, don't hold your breath. 15 in. Ladies, good job, guys. Got about twenty more seconds of rest here. Last round, we're going for a minute. Last two minutes of work. That's all we need.
All right, we're gonna get started here in five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Last round, guys. Pace yourself here. Remember to breathe. It's really easy when we're doing high cardio exercises like this. You're gonna to wanna to hold your breath. You gotta be breathing through it. Use your core to drive those knees nice and high. Don't arch your back as you're going. Going over halfway. Nice job, nice job. Use those arms, use that core. Keep pushing, guys. Last 15 seconds. Push here, push here. You guys are doing great. Less than 10 seconds. We're done in three, two, one, and done. Nice job. All right, last one here. I'll jump in with you guys again. We got fast feet, lateral floor touch. Last minute. We'll take a quick breather All right, ready? And go. Cardio portion is done. So we got about 30 seconds of rest here. Up next, we're gonna be going to our three sets of 10 push-ups with 10 clock push-ups. So we don't have to be on pace. It'll be your pace, your time. Make sure you're counting for yourself. All right. And remember. These are super seven, so you're going to do one right into the other. So I've got a couple seconds here. Now again, remember, whether you're doing push-ups from your knees or your toes, you really want to make sure that those hips are through. Over the weeks, I've seen a lot of athletes who have their butt here, and this is their push-up. That's not a push-up, okay? Make sure your hips are through. Sending your elbows back, okay? All right, whenever you guys are ready, you got 10 regular, and then 10 clap. Remember, if you can't bring your hands together, challenge yourself first, then move to a modification, all right? Here we go. 10 push ups. Nice job, guys. If you don't do 10, you can go right into the 10th clap. Do what you can, push yourself here.
Nice job. All right, we're gonna take a little bit of rest. Round out the shoulders if you need it. We got two more sets after this. Nice job. We'll take 15 more seconds of rest. Nice job. All right, we'll get started here in five, Four, three, two, one, ten push ups. Nice job, Randy. Send your elbows all the way out. Go a little lower. Nice job. Perfect. Nice job. Nice job, Aaron. Same thing. Go a little lower if you can. Nice work. Nice job. As soon as you're done with your 10, right into the 10 clap push ups. Nice job, guys. Nice job, nice job. Keep pushing here. Nice work, guys. Keep going, Erin. Nice job. All right, we'll take some more rest. And we got one more set of these. And we'll be moving on to some squats. Nice job. Last time for push-ups here. We have a little bit more time. Take about five more seconds. Four, three, two, one. We'll get started. Last round. Here we go. Nice job, guys. Get as low as you can. Think about taking your chest to the floor and then pushing it away. Make sure your shoulders stay nice and straight. We're not punching your shoulders here. We're being nice and athletic. As soon as you're done with your 10, go straight into your 10 clap. Nice job, guys. Keep going, Aaron. Nice job. All right, while you guys are resting, I'm going to talk about the next set. And then another super set. We have 30 air squats followed by 30 jump squats, okay? With the air squats, we're going to have the hands behind the head. We're going to be setting those hips back, okay? Same thing here. You don't want to start at the knees. So I don't want to see squats that look like this. I'm setting the hips back first, okay? You just watch your knees. I want the knees to come in. You want to keep them over the toes. All right. You have 30 air squats. Make sure you're counting. Go at your own pace. Hands behind the head. All right. Ready? Here we go. Try to get parallel with the ground.
Nice job, guys. Finish strong here. Nice job. Send those hips back, Erin. There you go. Nice job. Nice job, Randy. Send those hips back. Try not to fall forward. Think about keeping your chest high. We don't want to collapse here. We want to stay in one, one unit. Better. Nice job, guys. Keep pushing. Nice job. All right, with the jump squats, you can do a couple things here. You can take your arms back with you as you come down and up as you come up, or you can take your hands together and push. Either one is fine. Big thing here, you're gonna have a nice soft landing. Don't land with stiff legs. I'll let your knees bend and absorb you as you come down over that jump. All right. You got 30 jump squats, pace yourself here, but also push yourself, all right? At your own pace, make sure you count. Here we go. Nice job, guys. Push in. Nice job. Nice job, Aaron. Keep pushing. Nice job, guys. All right, couple more exercises. This next one is gonna be 20 alternating lunges, okay? You're gonna, do, you're gonna step forward into a lunge, right foot, left arm is gonna come with you. You're gonna lunge, think about keeping 90 degree in front as you drop, 90 degree in back. Make sure this front toe, doesn't come over this front, or I'm sorry, make sure your knee doesn't come over this front toe. We're going to be nice and stacked as you step, okay? You're going to alternate 40 total or 20 on each leg. Ready? Here we go. Don't have to be fast. Opposite arm with that leg. Nice job. Nice job. Think about pushing through that front heel. There we go. Nice work, guys. Almost done. Nice job. Keep those front toes pointing straight ahead. Make sure as you step, you're not drifting those toes in or out. Be nice and straight the whole way. Nice job. Keep going, guys. Almost done. Nice job, nice job. Way to go all the way down, guys. Another race here. Nice job of building up that strength in those legs. We don't have resistance. We make it with our body weight. Nice job. Once you get to that 20, you're done. Nice job, Randy. 
Hi, Sean, Aaron. All right, catch your breath for a second. I'm going to go over our last superset of the day. We have bed bugs and a 30 second plank. Okay. And just a couple reminders for dead bugs here. Moving on our back. And then to get to a 90 degree angle, we're going to have our hands straight in front. We're going to think about pulling that belly button into the spine. No light underneath the back. You want to have no gaps between your lower back and the floor. Bring your knees up. Bring your hands up. Right arm goes back, left foot goes out, come back, left arm goes back, right foot goes out, come back together. We're gonna do 10 on each side, then we have a 30 second plank, and we're done, all right? 10 on each side, make sure you count it out. Here we go, last set. <laughs>
We'll hold for three, two, one, and done. Nice job today, guys. Yeah, one more workout after this. Finish strong. Hope you guys have a great rest of your, rest of your week. Thanks again to Randy and Aaron for jumping on today. All right, so that's the time. <laughs>